33 will do the problems of kinetic theory of gases like this problems have been uh, asked in so many um, year question papers so in this we have to find out the formulas of kinetic theory of gases and different uh, velocities of gases we have to write down and <coughs> this is the one problem calculate the diameter of the molecule given number of molecules per uh, cubic meter is 3.25 in 10 to the power of 25 meter cube and the uh, mean free path is 2.5 in 10 to the power of minus 8 meter so first of all you write given things that uh, n is given number of molecules per unit uh, per uh, meter, cubic meter is 3.25 in 10 to the power of 25 and lambda that is mean free path is given to 0.3 into the power of minus 8 meter we want to find out diameter of the molecule the formula is like this we know that mean free path is that is lambda is equal to 1 divided by root 2 pi n d square so if we rearrange this d square is equal to 1 divided by root 2 pi n lambda so substitute n value that is 3.25 into 10 to the power of 25 into lambda value 2.3 into 10 to the power of minus 8. So if you multiply root 2 into pi into 2.25 into 10 to the power of 25 and to 2.3 into 10 to the power of minus 8, we will get 3.319 into 10 to the power of 18. Now 1 divided by if we do the value we will get 3.0126 into 10 to the power of minus 19 is the d square but d is equal to square root of 3.0125 into 10 to the power of minus 19 and d is equal to 5.488 into 10 to the power of minus 10 meter. So this is the diameter of the molecule like that one more one more problem calculate the mean free path of a gas molecules of a diameter 3.2 into 10 to the power of minus 10 meter the number of molecules per volume is 21.5 into 10 to the power of 25 meter cube so write down the given value what are the given values given values diameter d is 3.2 into 10 to the power of minus 10 meter we want to find out mean free path lambda is equal to question mark and n number of molecules per unit volume is given that is 21.5 into 10 to the power of 25 meter cube. So formula is 1 div, lambda is equal to 1 divided by root 2 pi n d square. So uh, they are given n value and d square value. You substitute that pi to root 2 pi into 21.25 21.5 into 10 to the power of 25 into 3.2 into 10 to the power of minus 10 whole square. If we multiply everything in the denominator value, we'll get 97.76 into 10 to the power of 6. You divide 1, point, uh, 1 divided by that, you will get 10.228 into 10 to the power of minus 9 meter. That is the mean free path of a gas molecule. Another problem is like this. Calculate the root mean, root mean square velocity of oxygen molecules at NTP is equal to 1.43 kg per meter cube is given. So we want to find out root mean square velocity means V RMS is equal to question mark and rho is given that is density of oxygen molecule is 1.43 gram kg per meter cube and uh, at NTP we know that uh, pressure is normal NTP means normal temperature pressure pressure is 1.01 in 10 to the power of 5 pascals. We know root mean square velocity expression is uh, V RMS is equal to square root of 3 RT by M. But 3RT by M I can read as P by rho. P is 1.01 .01 into 10 to the power of 5 and rho is 1.43. If I calculate, we will get 461 meter per second. That is the RMS velocity of a oxygen molecules at NTP. Next one is the number of molecules per meter cube of a gas is 2.76 into 10 to the power of 25 meter cube. And the mean free path is 2.2 into 10 to the power of minus 10 meter calculate diameter of the gas molecule so here given in this problem is n is given that is 2.76 into 10 to the power of 25 and lambda is given 2.2 into 10 to the power of minus 10 meter we want to find out diameter that the diameter is equal to question mark formula is lambda is equal to 1 divided by root 2 pi n d square rearrange this equation d square is equal to 1 divided by root 2 pi n lambda n is 2.76 into 10 to the power of 25 lambda is 2.2 into 10 to the power of minus 10 multiply the new denominator value will get 2.696 into 10 to the power of 16 
1 divided by that value you will do it d square is equal to 3.7087 into 10 to the power of minus 17 will get if i take a square root of that will get d is equal to 6.089 into 10 to the power of minus 9 meter that is the diameter of the molecules so next one is calculate the mean free path of a gas molecule whose diameter is 4.4 into 10 to the power of minus 10 meter and the number of molecules per unit volume is 1.5 into 10 to the power of 25 meter cube so given is diameter is given 4 into 10 to the power of minus 10 meter lambda i want to find out that is mean free path i want to find out number of molecules per unit volume is given that is 1.5 into 10 to the power of 25 meter cube formula is lambda is equal to 1 divided by root 2 pi and d square substitute n is 1.5 into 10 to the power of minus 25 and d is 4 into 10 to the power of minus 10 whole square if i multiply all the numerator denominator value you will get 10.65 into 10 to the power of 6 1 divided by that will get 93.83 into 10 to the power of minus 10 meter so these are the problems of the kinetic theory of gases First of all, we want to learn the formulas of kinetic theory of gases, pressure of the gas, all these we have to